welcome back to another video um today i will be talking about um what i did to lose two inches in a month and up to 15 pounds in two months um what i did was the grow with joe um workouts i did her app at first well first i found one of her workouts on youtube um, I was just looking for something like low impact that had gospel music on it as well. And so she popped up. I did her workout. It was amazing. And then I just continued to do her workouts. Eventually, I saw what she really does on YouTube. And so I had um, went ahead, downloaded her app, and I did her New Year's challenge. So the New Year's challenge was from January 7th to January 31st. And so I was like, why not just go ahead and take part of this challenge? When I say, I don't know what clicked in my head, but for some reason I was just de dedicated. I was dedicated from the jump. Um, with this workout, it's six days a week. And the workouts vary from like 15 minutes up to like 45 minutes. Um, and she also has like a challenge that she does for people that don't have the app and they just want to continue to use YouTube videos. So with this app, it's so good. Like you can choose single workouts, you can do challenges. It varies from easy, medium, hard. And then also have a, has a section where it also gives you nutrition based upon what your goals are. So it give you the meals that you can make per week or per day. And then it also gives you like breakfast, lunch, dinner, and snacks. But the, here's the kicker. It also gives you, um, it also gives you a, uh, what is it called? A grocery list. So you won't be going through the store trying to figure out what to get. Um, you can just look at the grocery list and it'll tell you everything. And it has like a check off. So you can check off the things that you need to get on the list. Um, with that being said, um, I'll go into what we did. I'll insert some videos, some clips. Um, but most of this is just be me talking, I guess, about the app. So, um, or about Grow with Joe. So doing her workouts was pretty easy. Um, I'm not saying like easy as in like the workouts weren't hard or challenging. The workouts were pretty much just like, they were fun. She has a great spirit. She's smiling the whole time. She sweats as well. So like a lot of these workouts that we do on YouTube or I do on YouTube, the person is not sweating. They're yelling. Like it's just not enjoyable. What I'll say with Grow With Joe um, is definitely fun because she's smiling the whole time. She makes it fun. Like she stops in between and gives you motivational speeches. Like it's just great. And it feels like you're working out with somebody that you already know. and somebody that is like in the room with you. Like it's, it's very nice. I will say that I do like the YouTube videos more than the app because you can tell in the app that it's like just a pre-recorded thing and it's kind of like I'm not saying thrown together but it's like it's just pre-recorded so um the app is cool but I do like the YouTube workouts better um I will also also say um that the YouTube workouts are a little bit longer so like sometimes if I'm looking for something more challenging um i would go with the youtube workouts she also has different workouts like it's not just burpees push-ups jumping jacks it's like some creative stuff that i've never done and that's what keeps me motivated as well and she doesn't do this most of the time she doesn't do the same workout twice so you'll end up doing like if you have a like say like a 15 minute workout you'll do probably 25 different 25 different um exercises for that just that one workout so you get like usually you get like 20 seconds on and a 10 second break in between each set of workouts um so either way i did the what got me kick started with her i found the uh gospel workout i did that and it was so much fun like i recommend that to everybody i've shared that video so many times with family and friends like my sister did it and she said she loved it so much like she it, it kicked her into gear with getting her you know um her workout journey or her weight loss journey started as well so i started with that but then i got the app and um i'll also put like you know a little clip it so you guys can see what the stuff looks like she has another challenge starting um february 7th so tomorrow but the, this is sunday so it's the 6th but tomorrow is another one starting but she'll probably I mean, I probably won't have the video up by then. I know I won't. So.
so uh yeah so you can always jump in at any time though you don't have to start on that specific day that everybody else starts on you can start anytime and just you know ride the wave with us um to the end and then a couple days after depending on when you start but anyways so getting into this um like i said um it was a you work out six days a week and um the it varies and i will say that i like her workouts because you don't have to do any thinking about it she makes sure she targets every different um part of the body so you would get like upper body lower body abs back chest um full body and you won't have to think about it she'll take care of it for the whole week so you literally just press play on the video and she'll do the rest um and you just do it and that's what i was doing i just did it and got it over with like i didn't think about it or anything like that i just did it and that was it um so what i'll say is total inches lost um on my waist i lost about and i won't get specifics yet um i'm not that comfortable yet but i will say i lost two inches on my waist let me look and see Hold on. um one and a half inches all over um that was one inch on my hips and one and a half inches in my waist and that was great for me um at the end of it all i did lose five pounds which was also amazing um and that's just with not even a whole month like that's just with like 20 seven days of just committing and going hard i'll say that out of the out of the 30 what 31 days i only um missed working out because we had rest days and then i took a couple breaks for myself because my birthday was in january um i only had um i think seven days off so th four or three out of the four weeks in january i made sure to work out every day after work and that for me is a um a congratulations a pat on the back sis because that was one of my goals to work out more days of the month then i don't so i will usually get to like 13 days a month 15 days a month 12 days a month 11 days but i never would get to like in the 20s so that's so exciting for me that i actually stuck with something for a month and it got to the point where i was like oh i'm like if i missed the workout or something like that i was low-key like mad about it like or i was wanting to do it when i got home I, it was just routine like where i would like usually my family we all call each other when we get off work i don't know why we do that but we usually all call each other when we get off work and we um just talk and every time they were calling me i was working out and they was like you work out almost every day and i said she does and she does she's trying to get look by june you're not gonna know me by june she's gonna be slim because all of it through here slim it down slim it down y'all heard about the y'all heard about the waist that's going down as well so i will say that um the first thing i noticed was like clothes was fitting like i had these pair of jeans that i washed them and i put them up because i could not fit in this, into them how i wanted to fit into them right so it was a certain outfit that i was wearing i was like i gotta you know i gotta wear those jeans that's my only really light jeans that i have when I put them on and they went on with no problem and they went up and it wasn't no problem up. What? I said, oh, I'm sticking with this. I also um, was putting on like a shirt. It's a men's medium. I had just bought it because I needed something to go under another shirt and they didn't have it in women's. So I was like, okay, a men's medium. Shirt was skin tight, baby, skin tight. When I say I just wore that shirt to work um, on Friday and when I put it on, it felt like a regular shirt why would i stop i finally found something that's working but in cooperation with that i also cut back on sugar i cut back a lot on sugar if i did want some sugar like if you know you know you have like your little cravings or you want some chocolate or something like that i would get like a little jello pudding cup like that and that was actually able to suffice it wasn't no cookies no cakes no donuts no candy none of that there is alternative options but i'm like why even put the taste in my mouth if you know what i'm saying like I don't want to i don't want to go back and honestly and truly with a lot of people um sugar is the problem like carbs are the problem so if you cut those out the sky's the limit for your weight loss like you will take off you'll skyrocket so um that's what i began to do just cut back on sugar um making sure to meal prep and it don't have to be nothing extensive like meal prep can be literally you make sure you find a vegetable you make sure you find a fruit or a meat and you make sure that you find like 
a carb that's not too much because nobody i mean it still has to be sustainable because it's gonna be your life like you're gonna want to eat on christmas you're gonna want to eat on thanksgiving so don't like beat yourself up about the things that you take in like honestly and truly like i did so well as far as like sticking with my meal plan like what i chose to do which is not nothing too serious i stuck with that so well that when it was time to eat out or it was time to eat like you know something that wasn't a part of that I didn't feel bad it was actually a reward because i haven't been eating like that every single day you know what i'm saying so like when it was time to go out for my birthday like i still ate good because i just like how it makes me feel but also too if i did want to have a little something have a little piece of cake or something like that like literally the people at my job they bought me cake and ice cream i had got a piece of cake i had got a bowl of ice cream but i literally had two two bites of the cake and like three spoonfuls of the ice cream. And then I was done. I just wanted to throw it away because the thing is that you have to change your mindset. Mindset pretty much to food is not a reward. Like that doesn't have to be a reward for you. Like you can't, I will say that I have been buying clothes and shoes. So something's changing, I guess. <laughs> I guess that's the reward. But I'm able to buy different stuff. It's able to look better on me. So me buying a certain type of shoe and a certain type of pant that before it would have to be a bigger size and I can start going down. I'd rather spend money on that than spending money going out to get some Zaxby's or to get a cake or to get some ice cream or something like that because it doesn't even do anything for you. You know what I'm saying? And when it's time to have it, like when it's a special occasion, I guess you would say, you don't feel so bad because you haven't had it in a while. But anyways, to get off of that, I just cut off sugars, try to cut down carbs. Um, I don't use salt anyways. Um, make sure to eat whole foods and make sure to eat at home. That's pretty much it. I'll probably um, insert some videos or some clips of the stuff that I did eat so you guys can see that as well. But all in all, Grow With Y'all was amazing. I didn't really, like, I the app, I don't, I don't think that they have a way that you can cast it to your TV. So, I had to do the app on my phone. Um, she had one week where you could do uh, a video on the app or you can do a video on YouTube and that was still part of the challenge. So I was able to record that, but I wasn't able to record myself doing the um, doing the actual challenge because I used my phone to record. And so I was using the app to look at the, the workout. So I have a couple things that I'll insert, but it's not nothing, it's not a lot. But um, I'll show my calendar, I'll show everything else. I'll show my fitness pal, what I ate in a day and stuff like that um and yeah that's pretty much it grow with y'all she's amazing i follow her youtube i follow all of her instagram channels she also has a group on facebook called grow with joe um unified and that group is so inspiring like i remember one time um i had tried to use a scale at my job and i had saw nothing had moved and i was like okay so i i i, I know you're not supposed to get on the scale on the regular but i was like it's been a month so let me try it out like a month i think that's long enough so i had got on there and nothing had changed and i'm like okay i'm not gonna beat myself up about it but i'm like what is going on and so getting in the group and asking them questions they were like you know you'll see inches drop before you'll see weight drop just check the check how your clothes look like if it's not a body fat scale you're not gonna know blah blah blah, blah. either way they were very inspiring and it helped me to keep going because i was like look i'm about to just do what i want to do if this is not working but you can't think like that either so i got back with it and since november i've been able to lose 15 pounds i'm so 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 excited about that because that what i've been doing has been working and you just have to be patient and fall in love with the journey that's what it is you have to fall in love with it because if you're doing it just to look good i, I don't I don't feel like I look too bad right now. So <laughs> I would stay here. Cause it's definitely, definitely hard. But if you wanna get healthy, if you wanna wear clothes that you wanna wear, if you have health issues, then just take it day by day. And I had to ask God too. I had to pray about it. Like God, you gotta help me through this because it's literally a journey. You gotta find out what works. And it sounds so cliche cause everybody said it. But for me, I'm not eating one meal a day. I'm not intermittent fasting for two days and then coming back to eat. I'm not doing that. I'm not doing no water fast. So I had to figure out what was going to work for me. Um, and yeah, and it's just a journey. I'll definitely be updating everybody on everything. Um, or whoever's following, whoever's watching. I'll definitely update y'all because I'm telling you, by June, 
slim in the waist, thick in the hips, that's gonna be me. So yeah, so y'all just stay tuned. Y'all gonna see more of these videos coming out. And thank you for watching. If you have any questions or anything like that, please leave a comment below and I will answer it for sure. Um, and we're trying to get to at least 100 subscribers by next month. So let's see if we can do that. It don't cost you nothing to subscribe. It don't cost you nothing to uh, like the video. It don't cost you nothing to leave a comment, even if it's just you go girl, or even if it's just, hey girl, like you could say anything. So um, yes, please leave a comment, like, and subscribe. And y'all have a blessed day.